The campaign known as Change Project was launched in April this year and is expected to end in April next year. President of the Law Society of Namibia advocate Romain Marsdorp says they will seek views on the provision of the current legislation on aspects such as the lack of access to lawyers due to high costs, race and gender barriers. The society will also consult a wide range of stakeholders in the legal fraternity such as prosecutors, lawyers, the Office of the Judiciary, Ministry of Justice as well as the Law Society of Namibia. The majority of people cannot afford lawyers if they have to pay for it out of their pockets. That's why there are institutions like legal aid, there is legal insurance. Um, we as the Law Society understand that we need to educate the public about all the other avenues that are available to them to access legal services. Lawyers are important, but they are not the only way in which you can get justice. Marsh Dorp, who is also the chairperson of the Change Project, says they will also investigate on whether lawyers are well trained if they provide quality and timely services to clients. One problem is access to justice, which I know is a big thing for everybody and not just in a Namibian from any specific class. Access to justice is a multi-dimensional problem. It's got several arms, if I can call it that. It's not simply a question of, can I pay my lawyer? First, you must understand that you have a problem which a court can resolve. So it's also about education. It's about everybody understanding that they have rights and how can they validate those rights. The Law Society of Namibia will conduct the survey during a visit at high courts or magistrate courts in Ventuk, Oshakati, Walfish Bay, Swakopmund, Rundu and Ketmansuap during the campaign time. Currently, more than 800 legal practitioners are registered with the Law Society of Namibia.